Yo, this is your boy Face with Q. How y'all with elevated reactions? 18 and up, 18 and up, eight, eight, under 18, get the hell up out of here. Ouch. You know what I mean? So, since we just sitting here smoking, we finna react to a video. It's Jonah Lucas, I'm not a racist. This one put me on Jonah Lucas, so I'm finna put her on Jonah Lucas. Okay, this one's and, put me And on. I think the visual and how the video is shot, she'll love that too. Alright. Here we go. Join the Lucas. I'm not a racist. With a Make America Great Ahead again. Um, I know I'm in for a ride. <laughs> With all due respect, I don't have pity for you black niggas. That's the way I feel. Screaming Black Lives Matter, all the black guys rather be dead beats to pay your bills. Yelling nigga this and nigga that. Call everybody nigga and get a nigga mad. As soon as I say nigga, then everyone react and want to swing at me and call me racist because I ain't black. Pound that then. Talking about slavery like you was around back then. Like you was picking cotton off the fucking ground back then. Like you was on the plantation getting down back then. All right. Look. I see a black man aiming his gun, but I'd rather see a black man claiming his son. And I don't mean just for one day and you done. I mean, you still trapped in a rut. And I work my ass off and pay my taxes for what? So you can keep living on free government assistance, food stands for your children, but you still try to sell them for some weed and some liquor or a fucking babysitter while you party on the road because you ain't got no fucking goals. You already late. You motherfuckers need to get your damn priorities straight. Wait, it's like you're proud to be fake, but you lazy as fuck. And you'd rather sell drugs and get a job and be straight. And then you turn around and complain about the poverty rate. Fuck out of my face. You can't escape problems. You can pray for some change, but can't break a dollar. Got nobody else to blame, so you blame Donald. He fucked the world with a make America great condom. My boy's dead <laughs> That was a racist. hard line. <laughs> Fuck America with a make America great condom. That was a hard bar. That was hard. But with a make America great condom. That was hard. My boy's been back. I'm not racist. My sister's boyfriend's black. I'm not racist. That's my sister in law's baby, baby cousin Tracy got a brother and his girlfriend's black. <laughs> <laughs> my head's in the cloud. Heard it's not enough jobs for all the men in your house. Maybe we should build a wall to keep the Mexicans out. Or maybe we should send them all to the ghetto for now. I'm not racist. And I never lie, but I think there's a disconnect between your culture and mine. I worship the Einsteins, study the Steve Jobs, but you ride Tupac's dick like he was a fucking god. Oh my god. <laughs> and all you care about is rapping and stunting and being ratchet, and that's the nigga within you. Music right in your brain and slowly start to convince you that you let your kids listen and then the cycle continues. Blame it all on the menu, blame it on those drinks, blame it on everybody except for your own race. Blame it on white privileges, blame it on white kids, and just blame it on white citizens. Aim it the vice president. <laughs> Bunch of class clowns, niggas kneeling on the field, that's a flag down. How dare you try to make demands for this money? You gonna show us some respect, you gonna stand for this country, nigga. <laughs> I'm not racist, I'm just prepared for this type of war. I heard Eminem's rap at the awards, who's he fighting for? Y'all can take that motherfucker too, he ain't white no more. Damn. It's like you wanna be so famous, you'll do anything for attention and a little payment. I can't take you nowhere without people pointing fingers. Pants hanging off your ass, you ain't got no home training. Put your fucking pants off, nigga. Put that suit back on. Take that do-rag off. Take that goat out your mouth. Quit the pitiful stuff. And then maybe police will stop killing you. Fuck you, what the fuck? I'm not racist. It's like we're living in the same building but splitting the two floors. I'm not racist. But there's two sides of every story. I wish that I knew yours. With all disrespect, I don't really like you white motherfuckers. That's just where I'm at. <laughs> Screaming all lives matter is a protest to my protest. What kind of shit is that? And that's one war you'll never win. The power in the word nigga is a different sin. We shouldn't say it, but we do. And that's just what it is. But that don't mean that you can say it just because you got nigga friends. Nigga. <laughs> that word was originated for you to keep us under. And when we use it, we know that's just how we greet each other. And when you use it, we know there's a double meaning under. And even if I wasn't picking cotton physically, that don't mean I'm not affected by the history. My grandmama was a slave. That shit gets to me. And you ain't got no motherfucking sympathy, you pussy nigga. I'm 
sorry, you can never fail my life. Trying to have faith, but I never fell all right. It's hard to elevate when this country's ran by whites. Judging me by my skin color and my blackness. Trying to find a job, but ain't nobody call me back yet. Now I gotta sell drugs and put food in my cabinet. You crackers ain't slick, this is all a part of your tactics. Don't talk about no motherfucking tax. When I ain't making no dough. You think you know everything, but you don't. You want to copy our slang and everything that we know. Try to steal black culture and make it your own. Whoa. Fuck, I'm exhausted. Facts. I can't even Facts. drive without the cops trying to stop. Facts. <laughs> they definitely steal black culture and try to make it American. Well, they have been making it American culture, but it's yeah. not. It's black culture. And we got to figure out how to get our culture back, y'all. Everyone, no matter what race you are, you know that this is black culture has taken over America. It's nothing you could say to deny that. We all know this. Just look around. Starship. I'm tired of this systematic racism bullshit. All you do is false shit. This the shit that I'm false with. And you don't know shit about my people. That's what bothers you. You don't know about no fried chicken and no barbecue. You don't know about the two step or no loose change. You don't know about no two chains or no Kool Aid. You don't know. And even though Barack was half as black, you hate President Obama, I know that's a fact. You can't wait to get him out and put a cracker back, and then you gave us Donald Trump, and that was payback for that. I'm not racist. I never lied, but I noticed a disconnect between your culture and mine. Yeah, I praised Tupac like he was a fucking god. He was fighting for his life way before he fucking died, nigga. Die, nigga. And all you care about is money and power and being ugly, and that's the cracker within you. Hatred all in your brain, and slowly start to convince you. Then you teach it to your children until the cycle continue. Blame it on Puerto Rico. Blame it on OJ. Blame it on everybody except for your own race. Blame it on black niggas and blame it on black citizens. Aim at the black businesses. I ain't saying I'm innocent, but... I might be any day now, treating everybody how you want in any way how. I swear North Korea about to bomb us any day now. And now I'm ducking every time I hear a fucking play now. <laughs> you know I make a lot of sense, but you just can't admit it. When Eminem went against Trump, that was the illest. Cause even though he's white, he let us know he's standing with us. I'm not racist, but I cry a lot. You don't know what it's like to be in a frying pot. You don't know what it's like to mind your business and get stopped by the cops. And I know if you about to die or not. Worry about your life, so you take mine. I love you. That's so true. That's so unfortunate that anytime we get pulled over, the first thought is, Am I gonna die tonight? Not if I'm gonna get a ticket, not if whatever. It's if I'm gonna go die tonight. That's how I feel. How you feel? <laughs> it go, what's gonna happen, go happen. You know where you know where it can go. You feel me like fuck. Yeah. That's the fear of it. Because the, the shit you be doing at the worst is a ticket. But you like, I can be dead though. It this can end true. like that. This is true. And I got I got an issue with the police too. So sometimes I can't hold it. And I got to cuss the ass out. True. All right, let's go. But I fucking hate you at the same time. I wish we could trade shoes so we could change lives. So we can understand each other more. Shit but that'll take scary. time. I'm not racist. It's like we living in the same building, but splitting to both sides. I'm not racist, but there's two sides of every story, and now you know mine. Can't erase the scars with a bandage. I'm hoping maybe we can come to an understanding. Agree to disagree, and you can have an understanding. I'm not racist. Now he got another black friend. <laughs> now you, you can tell that white boy grew up off hip hop. He spit the word. Yeah. You know what I mean? He was spitting that shit. What'd they say? We all humans. Go back a little bit. Hold on. Wait. Because I need time to get over there. <laughs> Lift it. We are so elevated right now. Elevated. There you go. We were all humans until race disconnected us. Religion separated us. Politics divided us. And wealth classified us. That's deep. That's so true. That's so That's deep. deep. That is so true. Dang. This was good. This was great storytelling. So this video, very 
simple but powerful. It reminded me of I don't know what came first, but the Kendrick video with Don with Don Cheeto. You know when he was. Yeah, yeah, when he was sitting there talking. They was, yeah, yeah, like back and forth. Like that was dope. So that reminded me of that. I don't know what came first because I'm just watching this, but that that reminded me of that. And I love that video. I love that video. This was great, but I, I love it. Man, these actors, they learn these lyrics to the fact where it seems like they actually saying it, which I love. I love that. He picked some really good actors. Do he do like. All his videos kind of like this, like storytelling. Uh, no, he got other shit. Where other him, people write but, rapping his stuff. Do he ever rap his stuff? Yeah, he he got. Um, you never saw Will Smith. Here we go, another one. Jermaine, face, <laughs> <laughs> face. This is the first time I ever seen this man. Listen to him since we've been listening to it. So oh, love, I have wait, heard. wait. I'm sorry. Visually. On. Yeah. Oh, this Will Smith finna blow you. Okay, so that'll be y'all catch that one too, cause we just here chilling. chilling. <laughs> all right, again, make sure you stay elevated at all times. That video was the shit, by the way. I 